Now, this three vitamin C derivative makes it a powerhouse. You guys, I did not see this What's coming. What's up, my friends? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing something very unusual. That is, um, I've done scrubs, I've done body washes, I've done face creams, I've done toners, I've done, I've done quite a lot, quite a lot. But I realized that I've not talked about niacinamide, different types of niacinamide serums, different kinds of vitamin C serums. So I'm going to be doing that over the next few weeks and days on my channel please support me give this video a huge thumbs up if you end up enjoying it and um without much talk talk let's get into it okay so the very first one that i've tried and that i think you guys will also like is roshan vitamin c serum the roshan vitamin c serum is on a very comfortable price point that means on jumia and on kunga i saw that it retailed for 2500 naira okay and then um that also makes it something that you can buy whether you're in uni you're in secondary school or you are even working class i usually encourage my clients and my followers to buy skincare products that they know that they can continue to repurchase okay in the future so looking at the price point of 2005 that makes ration a very good word option the second thing you need to know about ration is the formula and the consistency now when i talk about formula i'm talking about is it thin is it thick is it lightweight is it heavyweight is it tacky is it greasy this is what is um this is what falls under the category of knowing what a product's consistency and formula is so the consistency of this product is thin is liquidy it penetrates into the skin easily so most people usually just always want to get roshan okay now the next thing you need to know about roshan is the ingredient list now it contains i think 20 percent hyaluric acid and then what sodium ascorbyl phosphate now right off the bat i told you guys before that if you're trying to fix hyperpigmentation scars if you're trying to um brighten up your skin you need a very potent form of vitamin c serum now the issue with using roshan vitamin c serum is first of all the vitamin c derivative in this particular product is a less potent one but the reason why the manufacturer is using this one in particular is because the good side of using sodium ascorbyl phosphate as a vitamin c derivative in a serum is that it will last longer it will be very stable for a long period of time and um, it also mixes well with other ingredients when you put it together in a vitamin c serum okay so i'm guessing that's the reason why the um formul formulators actually decided to use sodium ascorbyl phosphate but as a consumer looking at it from the perspective of someone that has used this over and over again honestly you guys i had to use about four to six bottles one two three four six bottles before i could actually start seeing changes when it comes to that um uh, remarkable brightening that i wanted on my face and even at that my terrible acne scars that I had, even from just as little as a white head or a very tiny black head, it didn't get it. Like, it would just be there for a long period of time. And that's because the vitamin C derivative is not something that is what? Very, very potent for the skin. Now, the other thing you need to know about vitamin C is this. When it comes to putting it in a serum, there are combinations of um, ingredients that you need to mix them with in order for the serum in order for the vitamin C serum to be very, very effective on the skin. And such ingredients include vitamin E and ferulic acid. So from the look of things, this Russian vitamin C serum is honestly not fully equipped to give you that intense brightening to fade your hyperpigmentation marks. But when it comes to the price point, when it comes to the formula, when it comes to the little ingredients that the formulator was able to pack into this product, it is a game changer you are going to absolutely love it so yes on a grade of 100 i would give roshan about 65 percent it works for my pocket size as at that time and if you're also on that um budget i think it is really really going to also work for you the next vitamin c serum that i want to bring to your notice today is timeless vitamin c serum and you guys know that i've used timeless over and over again i think i've used timeless about two times now and it is the only vitamin c serum that i've used that gave me remarkable changes like sometimes i'll look at my face when i wake up in the morning and i'll be like oh my god my skin has never looked this good 
and I will tell you why. First of all, let's talk about the price point, which is between 9,000 to 10,000 Naira. So right off the bat, if you know that this is not a budget that you can continue to fund when it comes to your skincare routine every month, especially because it is also a 30 ml formula, like it comes in this small bottle, yellow, but it is 30 ml. Please, my sister, do not bother to start Timeless Vitamin C Serum. You can just opt for the erosion and then just wait until you see changes. Now, another thing with the Timeless is that it has a huge concentration of vitamin C. Now, the vitamin C derivative in this serum is L-ascorbic acid. Now, the reason why the formulator chose L-ascorbic acid is because they wanted to deliver results instantly to the skin. Now, another thing about the Timeless is that it is also equipped with vitamin E and ferulic acid that makes it deliver results in as fast as four to six weeks. Honestly, guys, I have used it two times and I've seen visible changes, especially with my overall complexion, brightening it, keeping the spots, fading it gradually, even twice as fast as it did with the Roshan Vitamin C Serum. Honestly, Timeless is such a good formula. Now, right off the bat, you also need to know that this formula is a bit tacky on the skin. So that means if you apply it all over your face, you will not just feel that, oh, immediate sinking into your skin. Sometimes it stays on the skin a little bit, okay? So that makes it, it, it holds on, that's the word, it holds on to the skin. You can feel like you've actually rubbed something on the surface of your skin and that is the timeless vitamin c serum for you now let's also talk about the percentage when you're trying to choose a vitamin c serum you want to make sure that you're choosing a percentage and a derivative that is potent enough for you to see changes really really quick okay now of course we've talked about duration being the one that honestly is not potent so don't, don't even talk about the percentage of roshan but when it comes to timeless it has up to 10% L-ascorbic acid. And dermatologists actually recommend that everybody needs at least 10% of vitamin C derivative in the serum for it to actually work and function as a great antioxidant for your skin. Okay. Now, another thing you need to know about this serum is that it is not exactly a perfect option for sensitive skin. Honestly, I would advise you uh, as you continue to watch this video, to keep listening to me because i will talk about the option that is very very good for sensitive skin but if you are using timeless and your skin is sensitive and you're not using a lot of hydrating essences and toners your skin is going to be really really inflamed because it is such a potent vitamin c serum i've used it i absolutely love it so yes it can be a bit harsh on the skin the concentration is a bit very very potent you want to tread softly even though I even used it in the morning and at night, but I made sure that I was using my hydrating toner first, my Coswex essence, before I now go in with the what? Timeless vitamin C serum. Now, another thing with using very, very potent vitamin C serum, such as this one, is that you need to make sure that you are following in with a good cushion moisturizer and a very effective sunscreen. If you are not doing that, it will be doing more harm than good to your skin because what that means is that of course the brightening is going to be there but sooner than later you will start to see patches of sunburn on your face because of how effective and potent this vitamin c serum is so you want to make sure that you're following with sunscreen if you're using a vitamin c serum that is very very potent like the next one on our list is balance active formulas vitamin c serum now this brand has been taking the nigerian skincare market by a storm because i could not believe it I jumped on the bandwagon quite late and I apologize for that. Some of you have actually tried the Balance Active Formula Vitamin C Serum even before me. But mm, sis, you still want to hear my side of the story. That's why you are still watching this video. So listen to me. Now, this brand is from England. They recently just started rolling formulas into the market, especially in the Nigerian market. Now, this is the one thing that I like about this brand. They came in with a mid-range pricing option so that means that this formula for example this vitamin c serum retails for 4000 naira on jumia 4000 naira on kunga i know there are some instagram vendors that even sell it for 38 39 and 37 so it is a comfortable price point for anyone that is on a mid budget okay and you want something a bit stronger than the roshan 
but you also want to keep it at a what? At a bay. You don't want to continue to spend 10,000 naira. She inspired on vitamin C serum every every month okay so four thousand naira is very very comfortable now let's talk about the consistency and the key ingredients inside this vitamin c serum the consistency is of course thin um but one thing i did notice is that the formula is very very small and that's completely understandable because honestly in reality no matter how stable your vitamin c serum is or the derivatives inside the serum is you only need it in a small quantity if you have vitamin c serum that is about 60 ml or even 100 ml by the time you get to 50 ml the vitamin c serum has already even expired and is no longer effective so i guess that's why formulators always keep vitamin c serums in short short um concentrated uh bottles so that you use what you need every month by the time you're repurchasing it you are opening a fresh bottle of vitamin C serum that is still going to be effective. And this is also a pointer to you that you are watching this video. If you know you've been using your serum, you will use it once a week, you keep it there, and it has been on your table for the past six months, since that vitamin C serum is no longer going to, it's not even doing anything. They are just putting water on your face. So go to your table right now, put it in the dustbin, and buy a small vitamin C serum bottle that you know you have to use every morning before you leave your house or even while you're at home now the consistency of this formula is thin it's lightweight it penetrates into the skin easily now the key ingredients inside this formula includes um sodium ascorbyl phosphate a little bit of l-ascorbic acid and then um ascorbyl glucoside now these three vitamin c derivatives makes it a powerhouse you guys i did not see this combination coming and i need to know the dermatologist or the cosmetic chemist that formulated this product because it is bomb.com i have been looking and trying and reviewing vitamin c serums and this one is a must have now um these three products or should i say these three derivatives now is it perfect for sensitive skin ah uh, no i would advise you that if you know your skin is sensitive hello i i please you want to make sure that you are not using the balanced vitamin c serum because of its um long ingredient list and because it has three different types of vitamin c derivatives i'm just giving you a very fair advice you don't want to use it and even when you are using it i would advise you that you use it probably once a day or start by patch testing it here before you see if it is suitable for you but acne prone normal oily combination all the three that i've described you can get your way around it even if your skin is dry um, dry skin dry skin use lotion because of its hyaluric acid content okay but if your skin is dry and you want to try the timeless use it the way i described normal oily acne prone you are completely safe and sound to try any of these three now let me give you something that is like an expo like a cheat sheet into the balanced active formula vitamin system of course they say it will amplify your glow and give you a more radiating skin which is obviously expected because hello look at the ingredient list now sodium ascorbyl phosphate inside this serum is a less potent vitamin c derivative L-ascorbic acid inside this serum in the small percentage that is in it is also a potent one. Now, the powerhouse, like the one that is doing the heavy lifting in this formulation is the ascorbyl glucoside. And that's because this one combines the effect of sodium ascorbyl phosphate and L-ascorbic acid into one. So it has taken the good side of sodium ascorbyl phosphate and the what good side of l ascorbic acid making it a good powerhouse for your skin so yes your skin is going to get brighter you will see a visible glow i don't know about hyperpigmentation because i have not tried it before i'm only going by what they put on their website and their ingredient list and with the reviews that i've seen with hyperpigmentation i think you should still give it time and you should use other melanin inhibiting what um serums for your skin so that the pigmentation can start to blend really really well with your skin of course with all the vitamin c serums that i've mentioned make sure you patch test if you're using the products for the very first time so that you don't see things like sunburn rashes or allergic reaction that honestly happened to me recently so now i have come here 
to give you today's dose of knowledge make sure you give me a huge thumbs up please like this video subscribe the stats are saying you're watching the video you're not subscribing i also want to see if i can make a seven day um youtube series that means that i will talk about different categories of skincare today i've done vitamin c serum probably i'll do for niacinamide then i'll do for sunscreens then i'll do for face creams and then i'll do it over a span of seven days but it depends on the support that you give me on that video because it's going to take a toll on me and sis just got married we cook now we clean the house now so for me to carve out time to come up here you guys have to encourage me and show me a lot of love in the comment section if you ended up enjoying this video please comment down below yes Enola, you did great today thank you for this video you just saved a sister and i'll see you in the very next one bye